The galactic empire stretched across countless star systems, its influence touching the farthest reaches of known space. Within this vast dominion, a new class of elite trainees, the Elorians, had emerged. These beings, endowed with advanced intellect and technology, were the pride of the empire's military academy. Today, they faced their final test, a mission to Earth. Earth, known among the stars as a primitive and easy planet, seemed an ideal proving ground for these promising cadets. In a grand chamber filled with holographic displays and the hum of advanced machinery, the Elorians stood at attention. A high-ranking galactic official addressed them, his presence commanding respect. The mission briefing commenced, detailing the objectives and expectations. The Elorians, with their sleek, adaptive suits and multifunctional visors, epitomized the pinnacle of their race's technological prowess. Their capabilities included advanced weaponry, environmental adaptation, and unparalleled data analysis tools. The official, stern and composed, highlighted the routine nature of this mission. It was, after all, just Earth, a planet whose challenges were deemed rudimentary. He emphasized the importance of this final exam in testing their skills and capabilities. The expectation was clear. The mission would be a straightforward demonstration of their prowess, ending in swift success. Confidence filled the room as the Elorians absorbed the briefing, their minds already visualizing the triumph ahead. The journey to Earth began with the Elorians boarding their state-of-the-art spacecraft. This vessel, a marvel of engineering, boasted quantum drives for faster-than-light travel and adaptive shielding against cosmic hazards. As they traversed the void, the Elorians observed distant stars and nebulas, their excitement palpable. The ship's AI provided continuous updates, preparing them for the mission's parameters. As Earth came into view, the trainees were intrigued by the blue planet. Initial observations from orbit revealed diverse landscapes, sprawling cities, and vast oceans. The beauty of Earth contrasted sharply with its reputation, piquing their curiosity. Final preparations were made for their descent, each Elorian meticulously checking their gear and reviewing mission protocols. The descent to Earth was smooth, the spacecraft's advanced thrusters and navigational systems ensuring a precise landing. They touched down in a remote, undisturbed area surrounded by dense forests and rugged terrain. Stepping out onto the planet's surface, the Elorians took in their surroundings. Earth's air was rich and invigorating, its landscape lush and vibrant. Confidence surged among the trainees. This mission, though initially underestimated, began to reveal subtle complexities. The Elorians, eager and well-prepared, set off into the wilderness, ready to demonstrate their capabilities and prove their worth to the Galactic Empire. They knew that while Earth was not the most formidable of challenges, it was a crucial step in their journey to becoming elite members of the Empire's forces. The Elorians began their mission with cautious optimism. As they ventured deeper into Earth's wilderness, they encountered a myriad of wildlife. Creatures of all shapes and sizes moved with an unexpected intelligence and adaptability. The Elorians, accustomed to more predictable environments, found themselves struggling to categorize and understand the intricate web of life on Earth. The ecosystem's complexity was far beyond what they had anticipated. Weather patterns were equally confounding, sudden storms and fluctuating temperatures tested their equipment and patience. Adapting to these rapid changes proved challenging, shaking their initial confidence. Their first encounter with humans was equally surprising. Expecting primitive beings, the Elorians instead met people who exhibited a rich cultural tapestry and sophisticated technology. The differences in communication, social structures, and technology led to immediate misunderstandings. Humans, wary of the alien presence, reacted defensively, leading to several conflicts. These encounters highlighted the Elorians' lack of preparation for the nuanced and deeply ingrained human behaviors and societal norms. The resulting skirmishes underscored the need for a more nuanced approach to interaction and diplomacy. Exploring human settlements, the Elorians stumbled upon technological advancements that rivaled their own. They were taken aback by human ingenuity in fields such as renewable energy, biotechnology, and information systems. These discoveries shattered their preconceived notions of human inferiority. They witnessed humans utilizing technology in ways that were both innovative and practical 
often adapting to their environment with a resourcefulness that was both impressive and humbling. The Elorians began to develop a growing respect for human achievements, recognizing that they had underestimated their counterparts. The mission's challenges escalated as they faced Earth's formidable natural environment. Natural disasters struck with a frequency and intensity that caught them off guard. Earthquakes rumbled beneath their feet, storms battered their advanced suits, and wildfires raged through forests. Each disaster presented unique challenges that their technology struggled to mitigate. The Elorians found themselves constantly adapting, their advanced systems pushed to their limits. The unpredictable nature of these events exposed the gaps in their preparedness and highlighted the resilience required to survive on Earth. As they navigated these trials, the Elorians gained a deeper understanding of the planet's inherent dangers and the strength of its inhabitants. The Elorians, initially confident in their superiority, soon found themselves embroiled in guerrilla warfare tactics employed by human resistance groups. Ambushes in dense forests, hit-and-run attacks in urban environments, and the use of improvised explosive devices showcased the human's strategic ingenuity. A particular skirmish left a lasting impression. The Elorians, expecting a straightforward confrontation, were outmaneuvered by a small but highly effective resistance group. The humans utilized the terrain, setting traps and launching coordinated assaults that exploited the Elorians' unfamiliarity with the environment. This clash forced the Elorians to acknowledge the strategic prowess and determination of human fighters, shaking their overconfidence and compelling them to rethink their approach. Navigating Earth's political landscape proved equally challenging. The Elorians found themselves interacting with various human factions, each with its own agendas and alliances. Diplomatic efforts were met with suspicion, as historical conflicts and cultural differences created barriers to understanding. Meetings with government officials, local leaders, and rebel groups revealed the complexity of human politics. The Elorians struggled to decipher the intricate web of loyalties and rivalries that influenced human behavior. Attempts to negotiate were often thwarted by deep-seated mistrust and conflicting interests. The Elorians realized that their advanced technology and knowledge were not sufficient to navigate the nuanced and volatile political terrain, highlighting the importance of cultural sensitivity and strategic diplomacy. The Elorians faced relentless environmental hazards that tested their adaptability. They struggled with Earth's diverse climates and geographical features. In dense forests, the thick canopy obstructed their sensors, making navigation difficult. Deserts posed challenges with extreme temperatures and shifting sands that hampered movement. Mountainous regions presented treacherous terrain, with steep inclines and unstable ground. Each environment demanded unique adaptations, forcing the Elorians to constantly adjust their tactics and technology. The planet's varied landscapes presented continuous obstacles that required innovative solutions to overcome. In response to these challenges, the Elorians began modifying their technology to better suit Earth's conditions. They developed adaptive camouflage to blend into different environments, enhancing their ability to avoid detection. Climate control systems were fine-tuned to handle extreme temperatures, ensuring operational efficiency in both deserts and arctic conditions. Navigation systems were upgraded to account for the dense vegetation and rugged terrain, improving their movement and situational awareness. These innovations gradually improved their ability to handle Earth's diverse challenges, demonstrating their resilience and capacity for adaptation. Despite the initial difficulties, the Elorians showed remarkable progress in adjusting to the planet's unique demands, proving their capability to learn and evolve in the face of adversity. The Elorians gradually adapted to Earth's unique challenges, their initial overconfidence giving way to a deep respect for the planet and its inhabitants. They learned to navigate the unpredictable weather, harnessing local resources to survive and thrive. The once confounding wildlife became an ally rather than a threat as they developed strategies to coexist with Earth's ecosystems. In urban environments, they mastered human guerrilla tactics, turning their advanced technology into a powerful tool for both defense and diplomacy. These successful adaptations showcased their resilience and ingenuity allowing them to overcome obstacles that once seemed insurmountable. As their mission neared completion, the Elorians prepared to report their findings to the Galactic Empire. They compiled a detailed summary of their experiences, 
highlighting the unexpected complexities and challenges they had faced. They reflected on their initial underestimation of Earth, acknowledging the planet's intricate ecosystems, advanced human technology, and sophisticated political landscape. Their report emphasized the strategic ingenuity and adaptability of humans, offering a comprehensive account of the trials and triumphs encountered during their mission. This self-assessment revealed not only their growth and learning but also a newfound appreciation for Earth's formidable resilience. The Galactic Empire's reaction to the Elorians' report was one of surprise and intrigue. The Empire's perception of Earth shifted dramatically as they digested the detailed accounts of the mission. Officials engaged in discussions about the true complexity and challenges presented by Earth, recognizing that the planet was far more advanced and resilient than previously believed. The report sparked debates about future interactions and strategies concerning Earth, emphasizing the need for a more nuanced and respectful approach. The Empire began to reassess its policies, considering the potential for collaboration and mutual benefit rather than mere conquest. In conclusion, the Elorians returned to the Galactic Empire with a wealth of knowledge and a profound respect for Earth. Their mission had transformed from a routine test into a journey of discovery and growth. The Empire, once dismissive of Earth, now acknowledged its complexity and strength. Earth was no longer seen as a beginner's challenge, but as a planet deserving of respect and careful consideration. This mission, though challenging, had forged a new understanding and connection between the Galactic Empire and Earth, marking a significant shift in interstellar relations. The Elorians delved into an in-depth analysis of human ingenuity encountering numerous examples that defied their expectations. They marveled at human resourcefulness, particularly in how humans adapted technology to solve everyday problems and respond to environmental challenges. For instance, the use of renewable energy sources like solar and wind power showcased a sustainable approach to resource management. Medical advancements, particularly in biotechnology, demonstrated a remarkable blend of science and practicality. The Elorians reflected on their evolving perceptions, recognizing that human creativity often led to innovative solutions that posed unexpected challenges for their advanced systems. This newfound respect for human ingenuity underscored the complexity of Earth's inhabitants. The mission also highlighted significant cultural differences and misunderstandings between humans and Elorians. Initially, the Elorians struggled to grasp the diverse social norms, traditions, and values that shaped human behavior. Through interactions and observations, they gained insights into the importance of family, community, and individual freedom in human society. They noted the rich tapestry of cultural expressions, from art and music to language and customs. These experiences emphasized the necessity of cultural understanding in interspecies interactions. The Elorians reflected on how their preconceived notions had hindered their initial efforts realizing that empathy and respect were crucial for meaningful engagement with other species. Technological comparisons revealed both similarities and contrasts between Elorian and human advancements. The Elorians were particularly impressed by human achievements in areas such as telecommunications, where global connectivity was achieved through satellite networks and the Internet. Human aerospace technology, though different in approach, demonstrated a remarkable capability for exploration and innovation. These observations led to reflections on the potential for technological collaboration between humans and the Galactic Empire. The Elorians saw opportunities for mutual benefit, where combining their advanced technologies with human ingenuity could lead to groundbreaking developments in various fields. Looking to the future, the Elorians speculated on the potential interactions between the Galactic Empire and Earth. Their experiences suggested that Earth could play a significant role in the Empire's strategic and scientific endeavors. The mission underscored the importance of approaching Earth with respect and a willingness to learn. The Elorians reflected on how their insights might influence future missions, advocating for a more collaborative and open-minded approach. They envisioned joint ventures in scientific research, technological development, and cultural exchange. This mission's long-term impact on galactic policies emphasized the value of Earth's unique contributions, marking a shift towards a more inclusive and respectful interstellar relationship.